some electric vehicles can drive over 600 kilometers with batteries that fully recharge in about an hour. Those batteries contain liquid lithium ions, plus a soft carbon known as graphite. But breakthroughs in electric car batteries are on the horizon. A new lithium ion battery replaces graphite with silicon. That's sand. Sela's battery debut is starting small with the WHOOP fitness tracker. This allows for, in our case, about 20% extra energy density in our battery. John Capitolupo says Sela's battery provides plenty of power, helping the latest version of the fitness tracker. And we also added new features and sensors, such as skin temperature and blood oxygen level sensors. But it's not just for fitness trackers. By 2025, Sela plans to sell car batteries that will extend electric vehicles' range of travel 40% before needing recharging and without adding weight. A metal called niobium may help electric vehicle batteries charge fast for a 200-kilometer drive. For a shorter-range EV, we can have a full charge with our batteries in five or six minutes. Mark Newman says the Niobolt battery may also be great for acceleration. Solid power's batteries are solid state, meaning no liquid parts. We are replacing the liquid electrolyte that's used in a conventional lithium-ion battery with a solid ion conducting material. Doug Campbell says if an electric vehicle's range is 500 kilometers, a same size solid power battery will let the car drive over 700 kilometers. Plus its non-liquid makeup prevents fires. It reduces chances for vehicle uh, recalls, which of course we're seeing right now with Hyundai and General Motors. Solid Power plans batteries for consumer cars by 2025. If we're successful, we're, we're going to have a role in enabling vehicle electrification. That gets me up in the morning. That's exciting. All these innovators say the world will benefit from breakthrough batteries for reducing air pollution and greenhouse gas. Shelley Schlender for VOA News.